So hi, it's me Twitter Copy again, and today I will make another tutorial about how to kill or fight stri strikers or stealth even more efficiently with a liner. Because like many people always are like saying, oh, it's just impossible to fight a stealth. They make too much damage. I can't hit them. Even strikers, they are so overpowered. It's just impossible to fight with the line. No, but many people know. I just fly liner. I actually just it's my main ship. I even kill more strikers sometimes than liners. And I think there's some small things which make me fighting better against those small ships. Because first of all, you don't need missiles for that. No rockets, no missiles, nothing. Even no boosters. Because I don't use boosters. I use RCS for more avoidance against liners and yes, it's just just like that. So here I have a small video with crews. Very it was very nice fighting and so as you see here is Savage Bien. He is being attacked by my point defense. And even if those numbers, those hit numbers, not ac are not accurate, they show like in other games it's like a hit marker. It shows me that I am hitting him. And he actually has to fly around to not stay in my point defense. Then there's another striker, which is being constantly attacked by my point defense. And sometimes the striker pilots don't realize they're actually already on low HP. And you see he's uh, just below 300. Now he repaired up again. And now Cruz hit him with a missile. And he is not actually realizing that he's getting attacked. Now, now he did. Now he's moving away. Sadly, I was in the carrier and I wasn't able to follow him up but look at this now look at this so here you know I got a killer because I waited until my b both computers are, are loaded that deactivated my weapons and always with the first weapon shot you know with, with the first shots you always have like an increased hit rate so always try to deactivate the weapons and activate them again and changing targets, like if you see your, your front guns, you know, like the first one here, hit again on the rhino. It hit again. Now he's trying to fly away because he sees, oh my god, I'm low, low HP. And he's attacking me also. That's that's if you can see those red lines he's shooting. And I'm uh, waiting again with my computers. And that's another thing. You have like to pu try to use like movements, like rolling and up and down movements at the same time. And when you do that movement, movement when you press the keys on the, on, the on the keyboard, then activate weapons with the computers all at the same time. Most of the times I can deal up to two or three, four hits. I even one shot stealth, which flying at me. Now you know, see, the first shot again, hit on that stealth. I got two hits on the stealth. And here we have Savage again, and he's now attacking the, the the carrier from above in a dead angle and then I'm com I'm coming again and you see I already hit him two times I hit him two times with why the computer's activated then he's just saying my point defense and then another hit and you know I I personally got a feeling that if you s hit a striker or stealth with the point defense constantly he's you hit him more you simply hit him more I don't know why and you know again the stealth I just hit him and it's even the ammo I'm using Tulium ammo most of the time standard ammo or the Tulium accuracy ammo or the Tulium what was it the the last one you know which gives you more minimum damage and you know that there's another striker now hitting me and even though he's low level I think he can fly okay still maybe not but and y you see he's getting attacked by my point defense and that that damage is not low the damage is actually not low if you in a liner and you know, see, with the point defense, I can't kill his his missiles. And now he's getting hit again. He's getting hit again, hit again, because I'm always moving and I'm pressing boost. And you see, I got the boost activated, deactivated again. Right there again. Because sometimes, even with with turning, that's another thing, If you, you can turn faster if you're not boosting. And yeah, that, that's, that, that's like a thing. If you, you can try to activate you can push boost boost at the same time and then activating the guns that's another thing which makes you yeah 
like make makes a thing. Yeah, I was like farming kills like a pro because I already had like made like what was it? Ten kills or something like that? Ten, fifteen kills just with strikers and stealth? In like ten, fifteen minutes? That's just just epic. What's just epic? And there's now coming a liner? So and here's another video and in this video I was with Admiral Jones, an X1 on the mine, and you see the striker? It's an MK2. And I know I see it I hit them already. It wasn't just itself, another hit. And you know there's a point defense attacking him and he's now attack on the point defense and look at the numbers, look at the numbers, look at the numbers. And there's another hit. And there's another hit. You see, I hit them what what was it? Three, four times? I moved to all the point events, it was like about three four hundred damage I made. Just like in those twenty seconds. So fast. It goes simply so fast. You know, and it's not just all about having high level guns and that stuff, but one thing you really have need to have. Or don't have. Don't one thing. Just simply don't. P guns. P guns. Critical guns. Never. Because with critical guns, I have already flown with them. I have three of them still, and level nine up to level ten, and you know I hit nearly nothing. Nothing. I don't even hit liners at one thousand two hundred. Don't, please, don't put P guns. Yes, just M or S guns. They are the best. They are simply in all situations the best. And yes, I'm going to make another video about why M guns or S guns are better than P guns and I hope I could help you and now for the end again I'm going to put here some text so you m can <coughs> actually like freeze the video and write it down or just learn it by yourself how to do it and you can test it and I have experienced like over one or two years already with those tactics and I always hit stealth I was even a stealth on cancer run called number three or NR three and I was nearly the only liner always hitting and killing him up to the distance of nine uh one thousand nine hundred. And even he even knows it. He even knows it and he got a lot a lot angry, pissed, whatever. And yeah, and that's it. It's just about having Tulium ammo, don't try with Qubit ammo because I never had luck with Qubit ammo. Try with the Tulium ammo and try with standard ammo also and try with point defense. Just try it. And try to put it yes, try to put it up to the as you saw to the numbers eight and seven or two and three and the liners with the with just eight guns, it's the numbers seven and six or the, yes, still the numbers two or three, and really it just just try it once. You don't even need a missile because th that single gun that they sight, it sometimes can be very scary to the strikers because if you have like them killing them down with the point defense and then you make a, s a hit with maybe critical hit with two hundred or three hundred or just make a normal hit with about one hundred twenty or eighty, that's still a lot of damage to the striker. And a lot of strikers pilots they don't always look at their HP. So you have to make them look way more around them. T it's not concentrating them. You're disconcentrating them. And that's the matter. That's just all the things what point defense does. And even with the stealth, like in the first video I already showed you of the first ex the setup explanation. The point defense is very good against str the missiles of the stealth, fired like 500 or further away, because sometimes if they are closer, they are just simply too fast for the point defense to hit them. And yes, that was actually all, and if you like this tutorial, let me know, like the, like the video, put maybe some comments and ask me for whatever. I'm a liner pilot and I can explain you every single thing in the liner you need to know. And if you would see more videos and don't want to miss them then please subscribe and yes I hope I I really hope I could help you and yeah keep tuned bye <laughs>